Today we are going to talk about engulfing candlestick pattern, how it is formed, how to trade it and also see some live trading setup examples. Let's get started. The engulfing pattern is a double candlestick pattern which requires two trading sessions to evolve into a complete pattern. In an engulfing pattern, the first candle will be small candle and the second candle will be a relatively larger candle appearing as though it is engulfing the previous candle. Well, sort of like Kumbhakaran engulfing the food offered to him. Just like other candlestick patterns, there are two types of engulfing patterns the bullish engulfing pattern and the bearish engulfing pattern. The bullish engulfing pattern will appear on the bottom of the trend and the bearish engulfing pattern will appear at the top of the trend. And as you may have guessed, the formation of these engulfing patterns signals a change in the trend. For the engulfing pattern to form, certain criteria need to be satisfied and they are number one. The previous trend should be downtrend in case of bullish engulfing pattern. And for bearish engulfing pattern, the previous trend should be uptrend. Number two, the first candle should be a red candle in case of a bullish engulfing pattern and a green candle in case of a bearish engulfing pattern. Number three and the most important point, the second candle should be a long green candle in case of a bullish engulfing and a long red in the case of bearish engulfing, enough to engulf the body of the previous candle. This shows that the long candle has engulfed the previous candle and along with it, it has changed the trend. Here are some examples of bullish and bearish engulfing patterns. Here you can see a bullish engulfing pattern formed in Axis Bank and the trend reversed post its formation. And here is an example for bearish engulfing pattern formed in Reliance and the stock price crashed after it was formed. Now let's understand the psychology behind the formation of this engulfing pattern. Let us start with the bullish engulfing pattern. The market is in a downtrend and is continuously making lower lows and lower highs. On the first day of the formation of this candlestick pattern, the market opens lower and closes below its open price resulting in the formation of a red candle. On the second day, the stock opens lower like usual and tries to make a new low. And then comes a sudden buying interest in the market and it drives the price up and up and makes it close above the previous day's high. This price action forms a big green candle. The price action on the second day suggests that the bulls are interested in buying the stock at this particular price and they tried to reverse the bearish trend and were successful. The bears would not have expected this to happen as they were expecting a lower close and this sudden entry of bulls rattled them. The expectation is that the bulls will try to take the price further above in the next trading sessions and hence the trader should go long on this stock. The exact opposite happens during the formation of bearish engulfing pattern. The market is in an uptrend and is continuously making higher highs and higher lows every day. On the first day of the formation of this candle, the market opens higher and make another high and closes above its open price resulting in the formation of green candle. On the second day, the stock opens gap up as usual and tries to make a new high. But there is a sudden selling interest in the market and it drives the price down and makes it close lower than the previous day's low. This price action forms a big red candle. The price action on the second day suggests that the bears are ready to sell this stock at this particular price as they tried to reverse the bullish trend and were successful. Obviously, the bulls would not have expected this to happen as they were expecting a higher close and this sudden entry of bears rattled them. The expectation is that the bears will try to take the price further down in the next trading sessions and hence a trader should go short on this stock. Now that you know why and how the bullish and bearish engulfing patterns form, let us look at some live examples. I know it is very hard to track all FNO stocks and try to find which pattern is forming in which stocks. That's why we have built this technical signal tool in Sensible where you can find in which stocks what candlestick pattern is getting formed. Here you can see some examples where bearish and bullish engulfing pattern is getting formed. You can also find the stocks which are near its 100, 200 or 50 DMA. You can always access this tool to see all the live candlestick pattern being formed across these stocks. We have dropped the link of this feature 
in the description and in the pin comment so do check it out so guys that's it for today's video if you love this video tell us in the comment section give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and subscribe to sensible's youtube channel i'll see you in the next video until then keep your capital safe and take care